last topic is negative resistance oscillator see usually we produce also uh, we produce uh, oscillations in two ways one we use positive feedback second method is negative resistance so we don't use both the methods at the same time so in whatever circuit you are seeing we will see whether it is able to provide positive feedback or we are able to create negative resistance condition and we accordingly generate oscillations we accordingly generate oscillations so all oscillators do not require all oscillators do not require uh, negative resistance or all also do not require positive feedback for the operation but if the positive resistance of the lc tank is cancelled by using the negative resistance of tank circuit then you can maintain the steady oscillations so devices which are using negative resistance are uh, stated here you can see dynatron transitron you Diode. So these devices have negative resistance. You don't think negative resistance is a phenomenon. It is not like a negative resistance. You can, you can see a resistance negative value. Usually in the VA characteristics, the negative resistance region is the region where if you increase the voltage, my current starts reducing. It does not obey, obey Ohm's law at that point. So you know in Ohm's law, V is proportional to I, R is a constant, right? So as V increases, I should increase. But because of special doping of these devices, as V increases, I will decrease, leading to what is called as negative resistance. dV by dI, the slope is negative. That is what is logically called as negative resistance. Don't think that they have a resistance value inside which is negative in magnitude. It is not that case. Logically, the resistance value is found to be 